Good morning. Welcome back to the vlog. Thursday. It's like 10.30 per my Valentine's Day present. Gordon made me take off work today and, well, encouraged me to take off work today. And then blew the surprise day early. No, he didn't blow the surprise. But yeah, he's treating me to a facial and then we're going to lunch. And I'm really excited. But we had a late night last night and it was fun. We played a lot of games and we drank a bottle of rose, sparkling rose, and I'm feeling it right now. But that is okay. Espresso a little martini. bit of gin, espresso martini. Yeah. And I woke up at like 5 a.m. and I couldn't go back to sleep and I just got like so ravenous. And I was just eating a slice of pizza in the dark in my kitchen. <laughs> back my skin feels so nice I'm like so relaxed I feel like that was the move after like drinking last night I feel like she like I don't know drained my face you know what I mean like my face doesn't feel like as I don't know like bloated or whatever but anyway I ended up getting a couple well a couple one product because I mentioned like my issue has always been blackheads and like I I feel like I do everything right and I still can't get rid of them so I was telling her about the like Tatcha um, rice powder scrub that I use and she recommended to do something like just a bit more abrasive just on my nose so I ended up getting this product I don't even know what it is it's called Elastin skincare we'll see she recommended it so I don't know I liked her her name is Anne and I went to Nirvana Wellness Spa in Northern Liberties in Philadelphia so yeah, we'll see how that works, but I feel like I will say, like, I, I try to use the scrub at least once a week, but she did mention, like, maybe use it twice a week, just on my nose. I feel, like, so terrible that I'm putting makeup on my face right after. Sorry, I'm looking at my viewfinder as my mirror right now. Right after a facial. I'm gonna go into, like, Queen Village area. We're just going in different parts of the city this afternoon. This is, like, my whole Valentine's Day present, which is, like, so over the top, but... We love, we love it, I'm not gonna lie. I'm going to a brunch spot called Bloom's Day. Yeah, it's in Queen Village. It's like, we've been there, the last time we were there it was probably like pandemic. So, shit, it's been like four years, damn. They have such a good brunch menu. They have like a, a croffle, which is like a waffle croissant. So like, I'm, you know I'm getting that. It was so funny, we were, <laughs> when she was like extracting um, this shit from my nose, um, she was like trying to just dis to distract me because it obviously like that's like the most uncomfortable part of every facial but like super necessary especially for me and my nose because i had so much congestion and so when we were she was just like oh have you watch been watching any shows and i was like yeah i'm planning on watching love is blind because me and jordan started it last night we started it and like that show <laughs> i'm obsessed with it i'm like so excited to watch it also thanksgiving is out on netflix i think on saturday or something it's like a horror slasher movie i don't know if i've ever mentioned this in my vlogs but i'm obsessed with horror movies like that's my favorite type of movie to watch i like just love scary stuff i'm like such a baby but i am i can't i don't know i don't know but i love scary movies and stuff like that yeah i want to watch that and then True Detective series fina season finale is on Sunday too. And I don't know if anyone's been watching that, but me and Jordan are um, really into it. But after that, I'm going to need like a new show to watch. Um, because like we're going to run through Love is Blind. Um, that's for damn sure. So if anyone has any good recommendations of shows, I love like True Crime. I don't like, I mean, I do love reality shows, but like I'm over The Bachelor I don't really like like competition, like the challenge or anything like that. I'm not a big Real Housewives gal, um, like sometimes, but not always. So I don't know. I feel like, like The Bear was one of my favorite shows. I loved that show. It was so good. I can't wait for it to come without. And Tell Me Lies, but I know I've mentioned that before. I'm so obsessed with that show. Okay, I just have on like just like sweatpants right now and just like a regular top, but I want to make an outfit out of. Jordan got me that Anine Big Bing sweatshirt, so I want to make an outfit out of that today and wear that. So it's like too cold out. I'm trying to get ready really fast because I'm so hungry. We don't have a reservation at this place, um, 
but they're like I don't really think it's gonna be hard to get in. I am kind of scared that they're not gonna be serving brunch by the time we get there. It's like 12.30 right now, almost one. And I feel like we're probably not gonna like get there until like two o'clock if I'm being honest. Maybe like 1.45, but we should be game, you know? Here is my new sweatshirt. I love it. Feels good to have something new, I'm not gonna lie. But I just did a little slick back braid. I'm just wearing these like black trousers that I've had forever, and then just Uggs. But I don't know what jacket to wear with it. I'm thinking this jacket. But maybe, hold on. I feel like I like the other one better. I just don't love this like belt right now. Yeah. Yeah, I'm gonna wear the other one. But officially, this is the fit, okay? So, H&M jacket, an bang hoodie. These pants, I really don't know. I don't know. I've had them for years. Just the Uggs with a stain on them, and then my little mini Jody bag, which I love. I feel like I don't really get to wear this as much as I, like, thought I would, to be honest. But I like the little, like, pop of green. So, yeah, I'm going to do that. That's the fit for today. So, yeah, let's go. I'm freaking starving. so funny I was just filming a TikTok and like the lighting right here on my phone is perfect and then I don't know I turn on my camera and it's just absolute shit um but whatever I wanted to show you before I bundle up because it just snowed here last night and it's getting cold anything that that GD groundhog told me was in fact a lie this is freezing but I wanted to show you my outfit. I'm just wearing this like basic Henley top that I got from Aerie like years ago and I love it and I'm throwing these brown Levi's with it and then my New Balance sneakers that are so old. I need a new pair of sneakers but 75 hard you know. It's really freezing so I need to bundle up so I'm gonna just do a little monochromatic vibe right now and throw on this Lululemon jacket. It's like you know a classic like pile teddy jacket but it's so warm like it's like one of those that like the lining inside i don't know if you can tell but like the lining itself is like super thick and so warm so that is what we were going with i'm hosting with my friends tonight everyone's coming over um my friends deanna and laura and then their fiance or oh my god husbands they're coming over um so jordan and i are gonna go get some alcohol. Probably just end up ordering pizza tonight. Keep it simple. But I wanted to make a little cheese board. I have some stuff for that already, but I do like the main part of this journey right now. And I call it a journey because it really is just that cold out outside. I just took Bible for another walk and I'm like, dude, I'm gonna hurry it up. It's so cold. Um, but yeah, that is the purpose of the journey. I am also hungry like right now. It's like three o'clock and they're coming over at like seven-ish probably, but I have to clean the house a little bit. Um, I have to like get the cheese board ready and I think that's it. But yeah, that's what's up. I just wanted to pop on and say hi. Oh, Ice cream sandwiches, 
Jordan's gonna make burgers for lunch dinner. So beef, turkey, ground chicken. We're gonna do soup. This is the best rice ever, frozen rice. So we got brown, jasmine. Jordan also wanted cheese curds, so we got cheese curds. Mandarin chicken, also such a fire thing from Trader Joe's. This is the most expensive thing I, we got, I'm pretty sure. Korean beef short ribs, I don't know. Jordan picked that out, I don't know how much. I want that classic, the sweet potato gnocchi. This is like my favorite lunch thing. It's the green chili chicken bowl. It's like only 320 calories and it's just so good. I love this one. An onion and pepper for the chili. I wanted to make banana bread this week. Got some coconut oil spray, some coconut and almonds, vanilla creamer, my coffee. Jordan picked this out for me. Some little sleepy time tea. Pizza dough in case we want to make pizza. Some cacio e pepe. Zigzags. I love these, but if you don't use them within like the first day or two days, they 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 turn. And then we got the, some beans and tomatoes for again the chili. English muffins, almond milk, buns for the burger. And then they didn't have the mini dark peanut butter cups, but we got the full size version. I don't know. We'll see. Some kale Caesar or kale for I want to make a Caesar salad this week. And then I opened these in the car because I couldn't wait, but these are so good. The maple pancake flavored puffs. So, so good. I'm obsessed with those. And then the best cheddar cheese. Um, gonna use that for the burger. Some taco seasoning mix. This is just gonna be for the chicken Caesar salad. And then some little like fingerling potatoes. I don't know, he might make that for, you might make that instead of the cheese curds. No, with the... I might not make that instead of the che I was thinking about it, but I want the cheese curds. That's wants the cheese curds. That's what I wanted, but those are good. We'll we'll smash those with some olive okay. oil and yeah. make them nice and crispy potatoes in the oven. So well, that could you could use that as a French fry substitute. Yeah, but I feel like we should just stick with being unhealthy for today. It's Sunday. I I don't know. It's like three o'clock and we we haven't eaten anything, so we're hungry. Yeah. Because we had a late night last night. Okay, wait, show, actually, yeah. What? I wanna show the vlog my outfit of the day. Well, I posted, I posted on my TikTok, so follow me on TikTok if you're not following me. But this is my outfit of the day. Just these pinstripe pants from Zara. I feel like- Trousers, you said. Trousers, well, pants, trousers. They're like swishy though, I really like them. These are, I feel like if you watch any of my vlogs, you've probably seen these pants at this at some point. And then, uh, v neck top or sweater, v neck sweater from Zara, and then this HM ribbed tank, and then just my new balance. Let's see them. Let's see the shoes. I feel like everyone's seen these shoes at this point. If you but haven't, if you haven't, I'm so zooming I'm in. Zooming in. <laughs> yeah, that's the outfit of the day. It's Sunday, we're gonna make burgers, and then True Detective season finale is on tonight, so we're gonna do that. And that's pretty much all we got, right? And there's Fievel. His eye is doing way better. Good boy. Do you have like a sign off that you do? No, but I'm probably gonna end off the vlog here. Wait, wait, sign off together. Did you zoom in on this? Oh no, you didn't. I haven't zoomed. Okay. Bye Jordan. Bye Jordan. Bye. <laughs> tell the vlog, tell the vlog bye. Bye.